Well, good morning, everybody. Happy Columbus Day. Today I'm going to make some turnovers. Let's see what they look like. These are uh, red raspberry turnovers. And I'm going to bake them in my oven. And I'm using a bakery mix. It's called for making biscuits. All you do is add um, the mix and water. And that's that. So the mix is one, a one and three quarter cup. So get that out of there. And the water is three quarters cup of cold water. And then what I do with my spoons here. It spilled some milk over there, so I guess I laid them down when I was. Uh, I'm getting like milk to milk while I was cleaning it. I had to lay it down. So this is a little runny. So I'm going to put some more mix in. Because you don't want it real runny. We want to be able to work with it. the mix I had just used. They so use that. Let me check. I'll be jiggered. I must have put it someplace. I had just opened it. What the heck? Okay, if anybody sees it, let me know. From where you're at. Huh. Well, I got a little bit here, so. So this isn't as runny as normal, so let's just put some down. And if you don't have any, I know I have some more. I just opened it. Um, I just roll it in the dough here in the flour here a little bit. I set the oven at 450 and I sort of just um, press these out as much as I can and still be able to pick it up so, there we go hopefully I'm going to be able to pick it up now the ones I made are red raspberry and these are going to be um, apple. So I'm just going to put some apple in the middle here or whatever you have. It doesn't have to be out of these tubes. Um, it can be uh, right from a can, regular can. But to me this is a little simpler so then I'm going to take my fork and sort of Mash this down. I'm going to shake some of the flour off, and I'm putting this on a um, uh, parchment paper. My goodness, what did I do with that other? It's got to be right here. I just used it in my uh, making out some more. Just a minute. I'll be done. Well, I should have enough here to make another one. You can make these as big as you want. I found out the, the smaller ones were nicer when I baked them. Because um, I baked them in the oven. As I said, they were at 450. The oven is. Pretty soon I'm going to get my regular flour out can't find any. Hmm. Okay. I'll put some more apple. And for me to find out which is apple and which is raspberry, when I put my frosting on, the apple I go around like this, the raspberry I'll go lengthwise. 
then everybody will know what's what. Because not everybody likes raspberry, not everybody likes apple. So, get this together. And I just sort of form it a little bit. And just do it like that. They won't spread, really spread out. They'll be almost like a biscuit. So I have a little egg wash. I put egg and a little water in it. And I'm just going to do it on the top. There you are. This really upsets me that I must have laid it down someplace. And I don't know where I laid it. Huh. Now I guess I gotta go looking for uh, the rest of it so I can make some some more up. But this is with um, the baking mix. It's just like making biscuits. It always calls on the back for just making biscuits, but one time I had some dough left over and I thought, I'm going to try this. So I did and then uh, this morning got up and I made these um, the bottoms. And these are, as they say, red raspberry. And they're basically gone like this when I frosted them. You don't have to frost them. I find some turnovers that aren't frosted. And I find some turnovers that are frosted. So, let me get my flour and make a few more here. Okay, I'm sorry. I'm going to use just regular flour. It'll work just as well. Mixing it with this. Let's get a little more batter here. Put it in the middle, and I started just... Roll it around in here to start with. And I'll pat it and then I'll uh, try going out uh, flat. I guess this one is going to be a little one. So I'll just put a little apple in here. I've had a lot of people come up to me and ask how come I haven't been baking as much, but things have just been going on around here and haven't been able to really put anything together. So uh, I got up this morning and thought I'd do some more of these and do it on the show. It's, uh, it's really nice that some people, we had a fall festival and some people just uh, came up to me and knew me just for my show and wanted to know what was going on. Says, oh, I'll be back. So, today I'm back. Hopefully it's going to be once a week now. So... We got the kids all home from school today. Of course, I don't have any yet, but we'll see what happens later. Okay, I'll just fold it over together. I spent the weekend at New Thane, my son's, for my daughter-in-law's birthday, so that was nice. Okay, and I'm going to wipe these with the egg wash, too. Um, the last ones, and I made some really big ones. They made, um, I think I did only nine of them. But these are going to be a little smaller, so, so there you have it. That's what it looks like when I put them in the oven. And this is what it looks like when I take them out of the oven. 
So Joe's already eaten one, so as long as he likes it, then I'll continue making them. But I usually have the test. If he doesn't like it, I don't make don't make it again and stuff. So so I think that's about it. I'll give you the recipe um, on my baking mix. Probably most of them are pretty well the same, but mine called for one and three quarter of the baking mix and three quarters of water. Um, you could put in just a hair less water because it will make it uh, really sticky and you want a little bit so you could work with it. Um, the oven is at 450 and it's for 12 to 18 minutes. And then as they say I egg washed them. And um, when I get the this tray done, I'll put them in the, in the oven and I'll have to clean up and try to find my other biscuit. It's probably right in front of my eyes. I can't see it. I don't know what I did with it. I may have just put it back in the cover. I know what I did. I put it back in the refrigerator. That's what I did. I rolled the top up and put it in the refrigerator. So I'll get some more, some more out and I'll finish making the rest of these because, well, I made four and I still have about three quarters of the mix left. So I'll be able to make a dozen probably. So anyway, have a nice day. Um, if your kids are home from school today, those that have kids, enjoy them. If your grandkids are home, really enjoy them. You remember uh, what their mom and dad used to do? That always that always gets me a little bit here when I I do little things that I wouldn't let their dad do and or their mother do when uh, they were little. But grandkids are a lot different, a lot lot different. So anyway, thank you very much for watching, and I'll try to get back on. The, Farmer's Market is still up in force, well, I think it's now from 1 to 4, I think it is, in the afternoon, so, but they're still in Fredonia, Dunkirk, I don't actually know where else they go, I've gone to all three of these, so I don't know where they go on the odd days, so, anyway, enjoy your day, I hope that you make some of these and come back and let me know how you like them. Again, thank you very much for watching, and we'll talk to you later. Bye-bye.